Hello. Hi, I'm John. I'm Joe. And we're in Call Studios. Uh, we made in Steve Jackson Sorcery, and we're now going to tell you about our latest project, which is 80 Days. Days is another interactive story, narrative, adventure, game strategy, game, trading game, uh, uh, roguelike. No, not a roguelike. It is a roguelike. Uh, so primarily this is a story based game, so when we start in London it'll come up with a really small snippet of story here. Yeah. Returning from the Reform Club at 7pm, Mr. Fogg pressed into my hands a small suitcase, gesturing that I opened it. I did so. Only to find, to my amazement, that it contained no less than the sum of £4,000 in banknotes. Oh, sir, I cannot accept. I began, stammering and confused. Fogg's eyebrow lifted a fraction. It's not for you, he declared sternly. Now hurry, pack two shirts and my evening jacket. We are going around the world. Okay, so what are we going to pack? Well, in the apartment on this playthrough, we've got a, ooh, a timetable. We definitely want a timetable. Yeah, okay, so that's train timetables. And then I think we'll take a pack of playing cards. Yes. Yeah. And uh, maybe this box of Egyptian they cigars. They're, uh, they're for soldier and luxurious types. Oh, and they're delicately fragranced. Delicately fragranced, though. So, when you're ready to depart a city, you can zoom back out to the globe and see all the places you can go. So, in this case, it's just Paris. So, uh, depart to 8pm. Off we go. Let's go. So, once you're off on your journey, up comes a bit of story and you have a little bit of an adventure on the route. And some of the routes are quite simple, and then other routes are quite dramatic. It's great the way that some people have real pride over the particular route that they took through games like Sorcery. So that's why we have a live feed of all the other players of the app and where they are and what's happening to them as they travel around the world and when you tap on one of them you can see what route they've taken and what adventures they've had. 